so cool. It's the greatest sport in the world. It's awesome. You should try it. Because if I had, I'd go to golf and watch my sport. Did I ever move my head? No. Because I was serious. When I get serious, I use my big muscles. I'm Kendall Griffin, I'm 17. I started when I was eight and I loved it ever since. <laughs> Whenever I um, was first starting playing, I played a lot of different sports and I got really serious with softball and golf. <clears throat> um, and I think what kept me in golf is that I could play it for my whole life. Um, you know, softball, you don't really see any 30-year-old softball players around. So, um, you know, golf, I knew that I could play my whole life and lifelong friends and stuff like that. So I think that's what really made me choose golf. Um, the more experience you have, the easier it gets. Each tournament, I kind of try to find my weakness of that tournament. Um, and I'll work a little bit extra harder on that to make those, you know, stronger. Um, and then, you know, just check out the golf course, see what we need to practice, like what kind of greens they have, uh, what kind of rough they have, stuff like that. Um, but I think mainly for me, I really try to focus on putting a lot because, you know, that's where you get stuff done. Um, and I like putting, so, you know, I make sure that I'm making those three-footers, four-footers, um, because those are what really win tournaments. I've always marked my ball with a cross, um, so I, I can never play if it's not marked with a cross. Um, and also, I like to wear different colored socks. Um, and they, they both have to be different colors and they can't match my shirt. It does make me a little bit more nervous when there's a lot of people around, but um, just having their support there is really, really cool. I know that they're not coming to watch me do bad. You know, I know that they want me to do good too, and so they know that everyone's not perfect, and um, I'm just looking forward to making a birdie in the next hole and stuff like that. But yeah, I love I love crowds. They get, that gets me pumped up. My whole family supports me. Um, they all root me on, and um, you know send me different quotes every now and then, motivational quotes. Yeah, I mean, my mom, my dad especially, they support me a lot. My, you know, my dad um, finances everything, and no matter what tournament I want to play in, you know, he's like, okay, let's do it. Um, you know, my mom takes me everywhere. Uh, we travel together, she's my travel buddy. I wouldn't be here without them. Golf is up and down, you know, you go on plateaus and in valleys and stuff like that, so it's not always easy, you know, to stick with it. You can't get discouraged. Have to keep on going, and that makes you know the wins, and when they do come, a lot better and a lot more rewarding. The golf has really helped my personality a lot. Made me more mature, you know, made me be able to handle life situations differently. Um, golf teaches you to get back up, you know, don't get too down on yourself. Um, and I think that's really helped in life as well. And two, you know, I mean, I've met so many great people through golf. I've been all around the U.S., I've been to China and Europe. So I love that part about it. And that, that's been super cool. It's affected me a lot as well. I'll get to be able to go off to LSU and I'm super excited about that. I see myself playing there you know for four years and hopefully winning a couple of national championships with my team and then after that hopefully going pro maybe be a college coach one day. I think that'd be a lot of fun just being able to see the college coaches that I've been able to meet with and I definitely just want to stay in golf no matter what. <laughs>